Welcome to Instagram Comment Automation Tutorial from ZebraBuzz Comment Growth Tools. To begin, first click on the Comment Growth Tools on the left sidebar menu. After the page is fully loaded, you can enter the automation campaign for Instagram by clicking on Automation Campaign Label or click on Detail. Remember, you probably won't be able to see all the features demonstrated in this tutorial within your ZebraBuzz account. The availability of the features depends on your current subscription package. The automation campaign of the Instagram section is divided into three parts. The left one is for your Instagram accounts, which are connected to bot-enabled Facebook pages. The middle section is where you will find all auto-comment-enabled post report, auto-reply post report, a setting to enable full account comment reply, a setting to enable mention reply and see all tagged medias. Then finally, the right side displays the lists of your latest Instagram posts. You can set the auto-comment and auto-reply from the list of the latest posts. To do that, just click the settings icon found on the bottom right position of the image of each post thumbnail. Clicking the setting icon will display six options. First, enable auto comment reply. Second, enable auto comment. Third, leave a comment now. Fourth, check all comments. Fifth, disable comments on Instagram. And sixth, analytics. Let's see the six options. First, enable auto comment reply. Clicking this option opens a pop up with a number of more options. The first option will ask you if you want to use the save templates. By default, choosing from save templates is set to yes. If you have set a reply template already, then you can simply choose the template you want to apply here. If you don't have a reply template set up, then change the default yes to no. We are setting this option to no for this tutorial. Next, choose the hide or delete option to let the app know what you want to do about offensive comments. Then, you can write down the offensive keyword separated by a comma if you are going to insert more than one offensive keyword. Now, you have an option to select if you want to send the reply multiple times when users make a comment multiple times. Next, you can also set the option to automatically hide the comment made by the commenter immediately. This can be useful when you want to manually unhide only the positive comments you want to be shown to the public. Next, we will set up our comments and our message reply. Currently, ZebraBuzz allows both generic and filtered replies. A generic reply will send the same reply to all commenters while a filter reply will respond to a particular keyword or keywords. Let's see how to set up a generic message for all. First, add the auto reply campaign name. Then, add the comment reply text you would like your bot to reply to comments. Finally, you can save your work and add all your settings as a reply template by clicking on Submit and Save Template button on the bottom left. Or, you can simply click on the submit button located on the bottom right, to simply save all the work you have completed. Let's now see the second automation campaign Instagram setting. Which is enable auto comment option. This option is used when you want to set up a comment reply one time or in a periodically scheduled type, without sending a private reply to the commenter. To set this up, click on the Enable Auto Comment option and a pop-up will appear with a list of options. First, give a name to the Auto Comment campaign. Second, choose an Auto Comment template already created. Then, choose from a one-time or periodic schedule type. The one-time campaign will comment only the first comment of the selected template and the periodic campaign will auto-comment multiple times periodically as per your setting. After completing the schedule type timing, click on Save. Now, let's see the third automation campaign individual post setting, which is called Leave a Comment Now option. 
which is simply an instant comment sender, directly from the Instagram account. When you click on the leave a comment now option, a pop-up will appear. In the space provided, you can provide a message as a comment. After you are done writing the comment, click on the create comment button. A comment will appear instantly on the Instagram post. Okay, now we are going to see the fourth option, check all comments. Clicking this option will open a pop-up that displays all the comments list under the Instagram post. The fifth option is disable comments on Instagram. Clicking this will open a pop-up. On this pop-up you will be asked to confirm if you really want to disable comments for this post on Instagram. Clicking OK will disable further comments on the Instagram post. The last one is analytics, which is the sixth option. Clicking this will display the post analytics in a pop-up. Let's now see how to enable full account comment reply setting from the middle section. This setting will be enabled for all posts on the entire Instagram account. To begin, click on the suitcase icon on full account comment reply, which is the third feature on the middle section of Instagram automation campaign. Another plug icon will pop up. Again click on the plug icon displayed. A pop-up will open with similar options to a single Instagram post, comment automation. First, choose the hide or delete option to let the app know what you want to do about offensive comments. Next, you can write down the offensive keyword separated by a comma if you are going to insert more than one offensive keyword. Then, you have an option to select if you want to send the reply multiple times when they create a comment multiple times. Next, you can set the option to automatically hide the comment made by the user immediately. This can be useful when you are able to manually unhide the comments you want to show to the public. Now, we will set up our comment reply. Currently, ZebraBuzz allows both generic and filtered replies. A generic reply will send the same reply to all commenters while a filter reply will respond to a particular keyword or keywords. Let's see how to send messages by filtering word or sentence. First, enter the auto reply campaign name. Then, choose the keywords that you would like your bot to respond to. Next, add the comment that you would like your bot to reply with. If no keyword match is found in the posted comment, you can specify a different comment reply here. Once you have completed the form, simply click on the submit button and your Instagram comment automation template is set. The other Instagram automation campaign is to create mention reply automation. This setting will make it possible to reply to all people who mention the account. To enable this option, click on the suitcase icon and a plug icon will pop up. Then similarly, click on the plug icon. Another pop-up will appear asking you to give information for mention of an account reply. First, you have an option to select if you want to send the reply multiple times when users make a comment more than one time. Then, you can also set the option to automatically hide the comment made by the commenter immediately. This can be useful when you want to manually unhide only the positive comments you want to be shown to the public. Next, we will set up our comments and our message reply. ZebraBuzz allows both filtered and generic. A generic reply will send the same reply to all commenters while a filter reply will respond to a particular keyword or keywords. Let's see how to set up a generic message for all. First, add the auto reply campaign name. Then, add the comment reply text you would like your bot to reply to comments. Finally, click on the submit button located on the bottom left to simply save all the work you have completed.
Alright, this concludes the comment automation ZebraBuzz tutorial for Instagram accounts.